I don't know about you guys, but one of the worst feelings for me is feeling stupid. I don't know, man. It just feels like ultimate disappointment. Because I'm not stupid, I've actually got a pretty big brain. But my school would say otherwise. Okay, orange guy, I need you to answer this question up on the board. Oh, uh... Oh, uh, isn't the correct answer. Wait, come on, kid. This is simple mental math. What? What isn't the correct answer either? Why do they keep giving me these idiots? Get out of my class. Ma'am, please. Get out of my class! Yo! What's up, guys? It's your boy, Orange Guy Animations. And my school thought I was stupid. This, this, this can't be. But Orange Guy, you're the smartest person I know! That's what I'm saying. I have no idea why my school would think I'm stupid, but I'll tell you the story and let you decide. So for those of you who saw this video, which you should totally go watch, you would know that I switched schools in the middle of the year. So I went from my old school, Trail Mix School, to my new one, Escuela de los Tigres, which was an accelerated school. And at Escuela de los Tigres, they did things a little bit differently than I was used to. So there were three classes that our grade were split into. A class, B class, and C class. A class were the super smart kids. B class were the average kids. And C class, well, they were trying their best. So when I joined the school, they put me in the A class. Which only makes sense because I do got that big brain. And I probably aced my entrance exam. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It all sounds cool until you realize I was in the smartest class in an accelerated school. So on my first day, I walked into my sixth grade math class and we were doing pre algebra. <laughs> And it wasn't the easy stuff like, oh, I wonder what X might be. Nah, bruh, cause she had us doing crazy math up in that joint. And they were deep into their lesson when I got there too. So I had to try and catch up with all the other kids. And I had a terrible math freaking homework experience. But we'll have to get into that in another video. But back onto the topic of this one, I was struggling in my classes just a little bit. Just a wee bit. And in just two or three weeks of me starting there, the school demoted me. They changed my class to the B class. Oh my God, no way. Yeah, yeah. I don't know who did it. I don't know how they did it, but what the freak, man? And it didn't take me until I was older to realize. Wait a minute. They... They switched my class because they thought I was stupid. And it wasn't even fair, man. It wasn't my fault I switched schools late. It wasn't my fault they were six lessons deep in one week. It wasn't my fault I had to catch up to all the other kids because of all the other things I listed. Unfortunately, the rest of my time at Escuela de los Tigres, I was still in the B class. Man, they just don't know about my big brain. They just don't know. Moral of the story, sometimes the circumstances just be like that, my boy. But hey, no need to worry because things could always be worse. So take what you got and do your best with it, man. And with that being said, I'll catch you in the next video. Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy, Engard. Orange guy, yeah, sir. Yeah, boy, we in here. Another video. Yeah, woohoo, yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, 
Man, I, I, I still have nothing to say in these end cards. Nothing cool's been happening, guys. Um, I wait. Well, I hit two thousand. We hit two thousand subscribers, but I talked about that in the last end card. Dang it. But yeah, thanks for two thousand. Still, that's still cool. We hit two point uh two point one. That's crazy. We got like a hundred subscribers in a week. That's insane. That's insane. Wait a minute. What the freak? That's insane. That's crazy, bro. Okay, I don't want to rant too long. Um, check out ojdripshop.com. Uh, pretty cool place. And subscribe. Your grandma's knees are in my pockets right now. I will not return them until you subscribe.